have it as state champion for Cleveland St. Ignatius. He is number one in the coaches poll right now. Is Dave Habit. Langus not ranked. And obviously no Hunter Stieber. Just nursing the elbows back to health. There's a left-handed head inside single right there by Langus. And the hop over foot pass by Dave Habit. And we're gonna get a stalemate restart. 18 left in the first. We have rank number three by Christian Piles. So, this is the match that we see at the NCAA tournament. If uh, no Hunter Stever, but I think we're going to see Hunter Stever at the Big Ten. I'll tell you what, anything goes with Hunter Stever. I don't know, maybe he can just wrestle. He's got a lot of hurt. Honored on senior night here. What a way to go out. This is the first round of the national duels. The winning team here. Winning team goes to Iowa City next weekend for the round of eight. And Langus has Ohio products. We are here at McComb Fieldhouse in Edinburgh, Pennsylvania. Home of the Fighting Scots. Langus in the white singlet. Habit with the U on his left hip there. Red and white. Red ankle bands. 130 left in the first. Scoreless between Langus and Habit. Hab Habit's only lost this year to Zertus in the Midland Finals. He has a win over Sorensen, actually. So, Dave Habit can flat out wrestle. You have it. Randy Langless, 105 left here in the first period. Scoreless, the dual score 11 0 in favor of the Buckeyes of Wyoming. And based on matchups here, uh, you're probably going to see the Buckeyes next week in uh, Iowa City. Probably going to see a rematch potentially with Mizzou. So. Nothing yet. 42 left here. First period. Have it, Landis. Both guys on the collar tie. Not much doing in that position right there. Looks like Habit's looking at double knee drop there. Pounds the mat like WWE style here for sound effects. Three point, hard to get much offense going. Five seconds left in the period. We're gonna go to choice. And after one, scoreless between Langus and Dave Habit. Langus' is choice, he is gonna defer. Habit will go underneath to start the second. Defers his decision. Habit chooses down to start the period. his feet. He's up and out. He's looking for a reversal, actually. So now Habit Langless trading. Still Langless's control here, though. Langless's ride time still going up. And Habit's going to get the reversal. So right now, Habit riding tough on top. He's got Langlis flattened out and going to work here. 105 left in the second, 11-0 dual score. 2-0 right now for Dave Habit, who's on top of Randy Langlis. And uh, Langlis making no attempt to bring his hips up right now. So we could see him get dinged for stalling. Now he does, and Habit puts him right back down on the mat. 
44 seconds left here in the second. 2-0 Habit off a reversal here. And the ride time at 42 seconds and climbing for Habit. So if he can remain on top for the rest of the period, he would have a nice little chunk, just over a minute of riding time. He's at 50 seconds now. Lang is completely flattened out right now. And uh, Habit's doing a masterful job of standing on top. Asserting as well. 13 seconds left in the second period. And now there's a tilt for Habit. He's getting swipes. And Dave Habit is going to get the full allotment of swipes. Comes right back up with a Habit can get a takedown right out in a major decision with that. So, if you're Langless, you gotta, gotta battle this third period. And he battled the first period, so. There's a nice hot outside attack, and it looks like Langless is gonna sit the corner and hook that back leg. Habit lift knees out of it. He's locked in the crotch here. His Langless looking to lift and elevate those hips. Maybe get the roll through which would be points in freestyle, it's not gonna matter here. And uh, good defense though by Langlis off the shot of Habit. 129 left in the third. 5-0 lead Dave Habit, and he's got 114 to right hand, so effectively 6-0. So if he can get a takedown right out, it will be a major decision of 8-0. Habit takes a little half shot there. Langus with his own shot, head inside single leg, stopped with it, and now Habit looking to hop over and foot pass like he does so well. Looks like he almost might be looking for a cradle here, and he does have a cradle locked up. Oh, what a pleasant surprise for Dave Habit looking for a ball here on Randy Langus. He can't stop on a shot. And Randy Lewis knows that he wrestles for the big turn. 40 seconds left. Habits ride time is now assured. So effectively a 10 0 match. And yeah, Langlis now has to bring his hips up. That was what Dave Habit was waiting for. And this is a very appropriate way for Dave Habit to finish his home career. And there's the stall warning on Langlis underneath. 15 seconds left. Dave Habit is going to say goodbye to the Macomb Fieldhouse and the Fighting Scots fans in style here with a 10-0 major decision of fellow Ohio State champion Randy Langlis. And there it is. on the board and it's going to be 11-4.